What's the haps folks, this is Professor App here with a let's play of Batman the Telltale series. Last time we continued our fight against crime and we went to visit Carmine Falcone in the hospital where, it, where we discovered that he'd been shot by Officer Montoya who I think was um, in control of that, uh, that strange drug that Bruce is inve that Batman's investigating, the one that, uh, that uh, was stolen from Falcone's uh, the warehouse in episode 1. Which I'm guessing, has, which might have something to do with um, Oswald's Cobblepot and his revolution, because she mentioned, because um, Montoya mentioned the person who attacked uh, was like talking about some sort of revolution, so maybe that Cobblepot's involved in this, and it turns out he might actually also be the person that uh, Catwoman was trying to steal that information for. Yeah, this is uh, definitely, definitely an intri intriguing mystery overall, so I don't really know where it's going to go from here. But um, I suppose we will uh, carry on with our with our crime invest investigation against the, uh, the crime and see uh, what comes out of it, I suppose so. How about we get started then? Talk to you urgently. Stack deck 6 p.m. No capes. Oh, is she? Is he going to talk to her about uh, Cobblepot? Stack deck 6:26 p.m. A TV there. A new twist in the race for the mayor's office as Harvey Dent backer Bruce Wayne comes under fire for alleged corruption. Joining me live is Mayor Hamilton Hill. Mr. Oh, God. Mayor, you said earlier today that in light of the allegations against him, Bruce Wayne should distance himself from Dent, but that was unlikely to happen. Why? He strikes me as, well, a jealous sort. Very possessive of his toys. Better keep a low profile. Well, uh, that's uh, definitely not good. Oh, there's a... there's a jukebox! Let's play with the jukebox. Oh, tunes for drinking, dancing and fighting. Not necessarily in that order. <laughs> okay. Oh, the bartender. You lost? Because I don't have time for tourists. Looks like you walked into the wrong bar. Selena Kyle is... You know Selena Kyle? There are men after her. Uh-huh. When aren't there? Well, these ones are trying to kill her. Hey. Don't I know you? It is you. Knew it. The cops take all your fancy clothes? <laughs> are you trying to lay low? Um, You're not really the low-lying type. Buy you a round? I'll buy you a drink? How about a few? <laughs> it ain't like you're short on cash. Leave him alone, Frank. Man's just trying to have a quiet drink. Oh, yeah, she is. You didn't seem to mind the company. Whatever. <sighs> Selena, I need to tell you something important. Better be an apology. You were supposed to take care of our mutual problem. Instead, you just pissed him off. 
Uh, now it's our huge oh, problem. Couple of his goons myself. Your client isn't one for subtlety. The man who hired you. His name is Oswald Cobblepot. Never heard of him. He goes by Penguin. Penguin? Shit. Mm -hmm. oh, you've got to be kidding me. He should have just killed me on that rooftop. I'm dead anyway. When you screw someone over, you really screw them. The Penguin. This together. Penguin can't take on both of us, and I'm not going anywhere. Clearly, you know something about him. I only know him by reputation. I'm surprised you never heard of him. He's a big deal across the pond. He's more dangerous than you think. Grew up together. I grew up with Oz. He's the first real friend I ever had. I'm not surprised. Questionable morals and a penchant for theatrics. You two have a lot in common. The question is, why Gotham? Why now? It's not like he's hurting for crime syndicates abroad. He thinks he's changing the world for the better, no matter the cost. Well, he's no Joan of Arc, that's for sure. Well, I'm not sticking around here to find out. Oswald, Penguin is about to unleash God knows what on the city. You can't just leave. A good reason not to be here when he does. You want to stay? That's your choice. If Penguin is everything you say, there's no tree high enough for you to climb. He will find you. So what are you suggesting? The bat helps the cat? And the cat helps the bat. Yep. Bruce, sweetie, the gallant knight thing, it really is adorable. But what would Harvey think? The two of us working together? After all, I'm not really an all work and no play kind of girl. Harvey knows that. This isn't about Harvey. I'm sorry, why, why are we talking about Harvey? He's your friend, isn't he? Just seeing how much of a conscience you really have. You and I... Uh-oh. This can't be good. <laughs> well, Bruce, you were right. Selena Kyle? Penguin says, hello. Beat it. We're here for her. You care about your own skin? You'll get the hell out. That's what it sounds. Said, leave! Gentlemen, please, sit. Have a drink. Let's work this out like civilized people. We're done talking. Ooh. Right in the face. Ooh. Let's give it to him. That's close.
Press beans at all. There we go. It worked, yes. Sure, I wasn't sure if I got it there. You felt pretty good. For such a pretty boy. Come on, this way. Are they not gonna get like are they not gonna get like really suspicious that to see Bruce Wayne fight like that and think that maybe he's not actually who he appears to be? No, oh, maybe they're just stupid. Quick, check the alleyway. You see anything? Negative. Let's check the other side. Probably what everyone else does. I'll take the rooftops. You take the alley. Wait. Just stay out of trouble. <laughs> now, where's the fun in that? You shouldn't trust me, you know. Alfred, I'm uploading the contents of a smartphone to the back computer. Check to see if there's anything on the phone we can use. Uh, processing it now. Is everything all right? There are quite a few police cars convening on your location. It's fine. Has the back computer found anything yet? Bruce, there are a number of messages here. All from Mayor Hill. Mayor Hill? Oh. Uh, the last voicemail is his. Listen to this. I gave you everything I have on Wayne. I've held up my end of the bargain, and I expect you to do the same. This is very shady indeed. Whatever they're talking about, it doesn't sound good. I should have guessed. Hill's working with Penguin. If Hill's talking to Penguin, he must know something. It's time I paid him a visit. I agree. The mayor must have answers, but... If I may offer a word of advice. People look up to Batman after how you handle Falcone. Terrorizing the mayor could damage that goodwill. Then again, Batman's methods would certainly get him talking immediately. Bruce would have to depend on his guile to loosen Hill's lips. Right, I see. So, visit Mayor Hill's Bruce. Let go as Batman. Um Let's let's go with Bruce. I think uh, I think uh, going as Bruce it means that it's less likely to uh, go a bit sour. Going as Bruce is the smart choice. City Hall, 7.03 p.m. Hey, look, there's this, there's a smash window. Sorry, the mayor's busy. Do you have an appointment? Uh, the mayor's doing debate prep. He really can't be disturbed right now. You're really telling me that Bruce Wayne needs an appointment? But the mayor... ...will be fine. And if he fires, he'd just come to work for me. Deal? <laughs> now things work. Bruce Wayne? Finally, you've come to see me. 
Of course, only after your name's been dragged through the mud. Don't get me wrong, I'm glad to see you. But you're a day late and a great many dollars short. Hey, Francis. This isn't a social call, Hill. I'm here for answers. Well, well, straight to business. And I was going to have Deborah make you a martini. Your father and I, we took this city and made it ours. Falcone too, rest his soul. We built everything we have. You were born with it. A soft boy like you wouldn't understand what it takes to rise to the top. Oh, I understand. Very well. I gave you everything I have on Wayne. I've held up my end of the bargain, and I expect you to do the same. Sounds like me. It is you. So? What's your point? I take it you have one. Or are you just fond of my dulcet tones? You're working with Oswald Cobblepot and his thugs. Working with them? They're a bigger threat to order than those masked freaks. I'm in Cobblepot's crosshairs, same as you. But you fed them dirt on me. Only the files I seized from Wayne Manor. Your father, Falcone, and I, we had ways of getting anything we wanted. How do you think your family got the land for Wayne Tower? Cobblepot wants retribution because we took his family's land. Oswald's family signed it over to us, along with the rest of their assets. It's a right to be angry. If that's true, then Oswald has a right to be angry. Is there any proof? Your father and I hid our tracks quite well. There's so much more I could share, if only we were friends. I could help you deal with Penguin, let you in on some family history. But I'm caught in a dogfight for my political career, and my rival has bottomless pockets. Now, if that rival were to say, drop out, or his advertising spend were to dry up, I might have a lot more resources for helping a new friend. It's a chance. Not a chance, Hill. I'm not cutting Harvey loose. Well, you dropped on your head. When the mayor of Gotham extends a hand, you take it. I don't need your hand. Not with your voice on tape. You forget who you're talking to. I'm the man that says I never left such and such a message. And all the judges bow their heads and say, yes, sir. I'm the man who sends the police to your house to take your things, and I give them to whoever I please. You're nothing like your father. You'd never have the backbone to do what we did. I'm the heavyweight, Wayne, and you're punching above your weight. Get out of the ring before you get hurt. I would never stoop so low. My backbone doesn't have the bend. Let me put it this way. If that voicemail makes it to the papers, or anywhere else I don't like, I'll turn my commissioner loose on your lieutenant for that fiasco down at the precinct. Gordon? Uh-oh. Then I'll turn him on you and Dent for being there. Oh dear. Now if you'll excuse me, I have a debate to prep for. Get him out of here. You know Harvey is going to embarrass you out there. Dent's campaign is on its last legs. Tonight, it hits the canvas. It's you who's going downhill, and you're not getting back up. It's, it's you who's going downhill. He's going downhill, get it? <laughs> I don't know if that was intended or not. Alfred, get a warning to Gordon. Tell him to increase security of the debate. Hill seems to think he's safe, but Penguin's still out there. What else is on here? I actually have to put it in myself. 
As per your request, Lieutenant Gordon has tripled security at the debate. Thanks, Alfred. It's a plan of the old Monarch Theater. The auditorium where the debate's being held. Hmm. I hacked into the image feeds from the security cameras at the auditorium. Just to be safe. Just to be safe. Hells, details about your father. They must have been quite upsetting. I can't imagine how you must feel. To learn so much in so little time. To be honest, Alfred, nothing can shock me anymore. Not when it comes to my parents. I wish I felt the same way. But I suppose no good can come from wallowing. The city needs you now more than ever. I'll, uh, leave you to it then. Well, latest polls show Denton Hill tied. New poll numbers find incumbent Mayor Hamilton and challenge of Gotham District Attorney Harvey Dent locked in a statistical dead heat of Gotham City. Mayor heads into his final weeks. Both men hope their upcoming televised debate to be held at Wayne Memorial Auditorium will be the event that gives one of them a lock on voters' hearts and minds. Experts find the latest poll results surprising, considering the deep well of resentment many voters have against Mayor Hill and the vast resources Dent commands. This suggests it points to possible overconfidence on the part of the Dent campaign when assessing Hill's perceived weakness. Despite the backing of billionaire Bruce Wayne, rumors... Main suspect in the horrific Dox massacre is missing, according to a spokesperson for the GCPD. The man whose identity is still unknown at this time escaped from the back of a police van shortly after being taken to custody at the Gotham Docks. He is suspected of being one of the gunmen as a brutal shootout that results in multiple casualties, including several GCPD officers. People are still seeking answers, but a source close to the investigation says the brutal nature of the crime has made it particularly difficult for the officers to assign, it, assign to it. Carmine Falcone murdered in police custody. Carmine Falcone, the notorious Gotham City crime boss, has been killed while in police custody. Reports say Falcone died, Falcone died from injuries sustained in a shooting that took place inside GCPD's downtown headquarters this morning. The identity of the killer or killers is still unknown and no one in the department is talking. Anthony Gatti, Falcone's attorney, told the Gazette there is a conspiracy of silence and we're going to sue everyone until someone starts talking. Falcone has been in police custody less than 24 hours when he died. He was apprehended by the masked vigilante Batman the night before. Distrust in Gotham's biggest concern. The results of a survey of Gazette readers reveals a widespread distrust in the institutions that support Gotham City, from the mayor's office all the way down to the street sweepers. Taken as a whole, it shows a city gripped by paranoia and fear. 9 out of 10 residents describe Gotham as unsafe or dangerous, and 7 out of 10 say major changes need to happen soon or they would move away, if, even if it meant unemployment or other hardships. Interestingly, Batman appeared to even evenly divide readership, with half of Gotham... <coughs> With half of response saying he made the city more secure, and the other half saying he made it less secure. When people talk about Gotham City, they talk about crime. And for the past, the past five decades, crime in Gotham City has a name, Carmine Falcone. His criminal empire was rumoured to be worth millions, and whispers of his influence are heard throughout the police department, city hall and beyond. So what happens when the man behind the myth finally shuffles off this mortal coil? Without Carmine Falcone, what crime is, is in Gotham City? What is crime in Gotham City? Furthermore, if our great city's single defining characteristic is called into question, then what defines us? If we no longer shackle to the blight of organised crime, then who are, who are we? To the citizens of Gotham City, if we have the opportunity to reinvent ourselves, who do you want to be? Who do we want to be, even? Nightly news there. Um, I'll just uh, look at the security cameras. Wait a minute. The images on these cameras haven't changed. Something's wrong. Penguin's men may have commandeered the cameras on their end. We could just be looking at... What they want us to see. Oh dear. Lord, Lord that he may have visitors. I have to get down there. Now. Well, that's not good. Hey, Bruce. 
Man, I'm glad you called. I needed to talk to you, actually. Something's come up. Something that's... Well, it's, it's not exactly... You're in danger. Oh, Harvey, listen to me. Your life is in danger. Because of Penguin and his thugs? Thanks, but there is an army of security here. They have me in some back room until the debate begins. For my own protection, they said. A little bit of overkill, if you ask me. It's not overkill, Harvey. It's a real... Please. I need to... Get this off my chest. Uh, look. Bruce, I didn't want to do this over the phone, but... Oh, dear. My advisors are telling me that I need to... <clears throat> that I need to distance myself from you. Oh, so? Until all this mess with your family blows over. They're afraid it's not a very good... I, I get it. It's the smart move, but let's talk about that later. I'm glad you see it that way. What with the allegations in the press, and now this mess with Falcone, you're a liability. But here's the thing, Bruce. Without your money... I am dead in the water. I know this is a delicate topic, but I need you to keep me afloat. I may have to trash you in public, but you and me, we'll know the truth about our friendship. As long as you win. No matter what, we need a new mayor. Hill needs to be removed. Fine, I knew you'd see it that way. Listen, I hate to push you, but I... I need to know. Can I count on your money, Bruce? Of course you can. Whatever it takes to save Gotham. I'll always support you, Harvey. Oh, thank you, Bruce. Thank you. You don't know how much this means to me. To Gotham. I'm sorry, Bruce. The makeup person is here. <laughs> Guess she needs to put on my face. I hope you can still watch the debate somewhere. They had to put that in, didn't they? to say tonight, remember. You are always my friend. Harvey! Wayne Memorial Auditorium, 8.27 p.m. Oh, there's Gordon. Matt. Yeah, all quiet so far. I've got a feeling that's about to change. I'm glad I took a chance on this... this collaboration of ours. Keep on doing what you're doing, and the rest of Gotham will start to see you like I do. A hero. Hero is a lofty title. I hope I live up to it. Could be tonight's the night to prove it. We have bigger things to worry about right now. Your security has been compromised. I've got patrols on every door. You better check on them. Oh. I'd keep that holstered if I were you. What's she doing here? She was part of that robbery at the mayor's office. Really? You're gonna drag out that dead horse? The break-in isn't important. Protecting the debate is. You should be thrilled. You're getting a twofer. And double the trouble from the looks of it. <laughs> oh, this better not Indeed. Come back to bite me. Alpha Patrol, come in. That, um, incident in the bar. Dead is its own kind of cage. I can't stand being in it. Not that I needed your help or anything, but you had my back. I thought I'd repay the favor. You know, like you scratch my back, I cut some people up. So for you yet. Doing the right thing. Maybe there's hope for you yet. Don't read too much into it. I'm just allergic to owing you anything. None of my men on the ground are responding. Enough waiting. We're going in. Alpha! I can't be good. Read. Now aren't you glad I'm here? <laughs> well, you have a better shot than my SWAT team of getting in there quietly. Hey, it's the, it's the drones. We are seriously underfunded at the GCPD. Sounds like a vote for Dan, Lieutenant. Good evening, everyone. Good evening, everyone, and welcome to our live debate for the next mayor of Gotham City. This is an important debate for these two candidates, incumbent Mayor Hamilton Hills and the challenger Gotham District Attorney Harvey Dent. 
And it's also important for you, the citizens of God, who will soon head to the polls to decide the future of your home, a city that's faced its share of hardships in recent years. Thought he might be here. <gasps> At least we know why they weren't responding. Gordon, we found one of your patrols. They've been terminated. Oh, those goddamn sons of gents, As you might have guessed, oh, it's Penguin. we changed to tonight's program. First order of business, firing the moderator! The mask is wearing. I hate to be a downer, but these hostages, I don't like their chances. No one else dies. If we're quick and decisive, no one else has to die. If you say so. But Penguin's playing for keeps. Fanatics always do. <gasps> You'll do. Get out here. That's uh, Vicky Vale, isn't it? Back there. These guys are armed to the teeth. Uh, we need a new moderator. Come on, you. You there. Yes. <laughs> you. Thank you for Wait. volunteering. Please. No. Go on then, introduce the candidates. Stage fright, huh? All right, I'll get you started, but this is your show. Three hostiles, gotta take them out quietly. Yeah, we're gonna do this then. There's one, two, and three. Right, so let's do this one first. Hey, just to uh, link the light stand then. Oh, light stand. What's that? Oh, that's Catwoman. Ceiling. What's this one say? Clear sight line across the whole room. Uh, let's just go to the light stand. with it. Okay. Try this one. So we have, uh, what's it say? Flanking position able to call for help. Got the door, heavy duty muffles, muffles sound to and from the stage and the table. Uh, let's go with the door. Now this one. But let's forward gunman. Facing away vulnerable. Guess I'll just use the camera stand. Two down. The last one. There we are. Stop it. Ooh. Maybe next time. Keep your heads down. Make for the police line. Okay, just get the hell out of there. And now, a word from our sponsor. My dumb brothers and sisters of color, 
You have nothing to fear. We are the children of our... Ow. We are here to end the masquerade. And expose the corruption that moved in your city. For too long, men like your esteemed mayor have profited... Friends of yours? Did you ever meet the guy on the screen? Nope. Smart to let someone else do your dirty work. Look into the hearts of these spineless creatures. Chosen to lead. Go on, love. You know what to do. What's she doing? Oh! Everybody in Gotham saw that moderator get shot on live TV. What's going on in there? First off, we should insert it. There we are. There we are. <laughs> We're out of time, Batman! The brass is going nuts with those two drugs on stage! Hey, it's the drone. Oh, I need to move along here. Thomas Wayne. Dad. I thought your father was dead. Subject 9. Esther Cobblepot. You've been declared criminally insane and committed to Arkham indefinitely as a ward of the state. Oh dear. Please. I'll sell you the land. Please don't do this. You had your chance. You should have made the deal we offered you. Give her the drug. Thomas. Oh god. You were warned, Esther. You know I always get what I want. Commence the procedure. Give her a dose she won't come back from. Now you know. Now you will see. Why don't you just do that before? Go! Why don't you kick the crap out of him? Thomas Wayne, that, 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 that was all him. He didn't know when to stop. I had him killed because of it. You liar. Don't want me back, my poor old mum. So this is for her. You won't let you kill anyone else. Wait your turn, Dent. Oh, he was dead. Takes you out. Hopefully. Where's your maid, Bruce Wayne? 
your biggest supporter, and you didn't yes. even turn up. Yes. Yes. Batman! The revolution's already started! It's too late to join! <laughs> Um, I'm not here to join. I'm not here to join you. I'm here to crush you. That's what I was afraid of. <laughs> oh god, I know where this is going. Now I've got to make a choice, haven't I? Save Selena or save Harvey. Save Harvey! I want to save Harvey. Mr. Gant. Quickly, quickly. Thanks. Freeze! I said freeze! Hold your fire, dammit! She's gone. Where's the maniac in the mask? What's that? No, that's not the chemical that's uh, used to make... to make people do what... That's not the chemical they used to make people do what they want, is it? And dent and dent's been injected with it, hasn't it? City Hall is in chaos after Mayor Hamilton Hill was confirmed dead. While several members of the Children of Arkham have been arrested, the Penguin is still at large. Meanwhile, the Wayne family scandal continued to escalate after the full list of Thomas Wayne's victims was released to the public. Mr. Wayne. Lieutenant. He's lucky, you know. Could have been much worse if the Batman hadn't been there. But there still will be scars. No, it's not. He's been injected with that drug, hasn't he? Look at the blood. There! <laughs> Come on, she kinda got far. representing Bruce Wayne have no comment at this time. We are the children of Arkham, and we have opened your eyes. Who is that? Oh, is that episode two finished? Episode two, Children of Arkham. Fresh to download the latest choices. Okay. Continue to next time on. Okay, I guess I'll have a look at um, at uh, episode what the preview for episode three then. Next time on Batman, the Telltale series. Batman saved me, but I know this isn't over. Who are these people, Bruce? Authorities are scrambling. The so-called children of Arkham have the city in a frenzy, but there's still no sign of their masked leader. With Hill and Falcone dead by their hands, the question on everyone's lips is, who's next? After that news about your father sending innocent people to Arkham, it sounds like the whole city wants your head on a pike. The Waynes have always run this company, but now... they want to decide what your future at this company will be. Do you really think Bruce Wayne is worth protecting?
What do you want from me? You know what I want. No more hiding! Not for anyone. But don't worry. Bruce Wayne's finally gonna get what's coming to him. Bruce! Bruce! That looks that looks like it's gonna be interesting. Well, uh, that was uh, that was a definitely action-packed uh, episode, second episode. So now um, Hamilton Hill's dead, and I suppose um, I don't know what uh, the mayor the mayor election is election is going to be like, given that um, Harvey Dent's basically out of commission now. And it's, I don't know what, I don't know whether it was actually at any point in saving Harvey at all, because I'm betting I'm betting that he's going to end up going to end up becoming Two Face anyway. And um, yeah, that's uh, that's leader of the Children of Arkham seems to be interesting. I'm intrigued to find out who they could possibly be. And uh, I suppose uh, we will find out in the next episode. Although, given that I think uh, in the next episode we're probably going to see what what uh, how Bruce Wayne's going to deal with this um, with this news against his uh, against his family's name, and um, we'll get uh, it's definitely it's definitely um, I'm really am finding this interesting overall. Trying to see to see how it all pans out. But I suppose we will continue this in the next episode. So if you like this video, then please, please give it a like. If you're not already subscribed, it really does help me out to get my channel known. And if you want to see more Batman and Telltale series, if you have any suggestions of your own of what I should play, then feel free to leave a comment in the comment section below. And until next time, folks, bye.